Everybody, welcome back to Padfoot TD Games. My name is Zach. I'm the voice behind the icon, and today we are in American Truck Sim doing something brand new to us today, and it's actually just came out. But of course, by the time you see the video, it is actually going to have a pretty lengthy delay on it, probably almost a month. And I do apologize for the gaps between when I'm filming things, but it's still going to be a good time. We are going to be doing some oversized load with the new oversized loads pack, the new DLC that came out. Very excited about this. Also, bada boom, bada bing. I didn't know this was supposed to be out yet. This is the new Volvo that's in the game. Um, with the new Volvo coming in, it actually did mess up our other mods. So I like the one that's by Aerodeth better um, than the one that's in-game. It's nice to see a Volvo in the game, but I will be honest. It, I like the other one a lot more with the customization that we have. This, this one's not bad by SES, and to now come with the game, I think that's a fantastic step that they're making. But definitely going to stick with the other ones but hey i think at least we'll get cables so that's something to look forward to so let's fire it up of course we did decorate a little bit on the inside we've got nugget and we've got a little pac-man up there also <coughs> uh, since i'm recording this i know you're gonna tell me engine malfunction i crashed a truck i was hoping we weren't gonna have that much problems um I, from other videos people that heard me talking about ella getting spayed well she just came home She's doing fine. She's very tired. She's very, very tired. Man, this is crazy. All right, this is the job that we want to take. Truck tanks were refilled and driver hours restored. Oh, look at this. Look at this, everybody. <coughs> I've only seen one video of this so far. I didn't know they gave you all these, like, cinematic shit going on. Oh, man, I'm nervous now. I don't feel like I got a big enough truck for this. Cinematic shots, that's a neat touch. Yeah, this is loading the route. So we get like a pull police escort. Okay. You're about to haul special transport cargo. There are two escort vehicles which will lead you. Please be careful and follow their lead and suggestions in the route advisor. Special transports like this don't stop on a red signal and have the right of way in most situations. During these deliveries, checkpoints are made more often to save your current progress. So that tells me something that can go very wrong. Pay attention to the following. Avoid any possible conflict with an escort vehicle and keep the cargo between them. Do not drive out of the estimated route, nor to a refill station, rest stops, etc. So these are all meant to be able to be done one shot. Obey speed limitations, which will be ensured by the front escort vehicle. Watch out for overtaking traffic and other drivers on the road change lane maneuver the maneuver is started by the rear escort by changing and blocking the designated lane then the front then main okay that's fine if you do not follow these rules your special transportation mission may fail oh great <coughs> well here we are everybody i gather that's my escort <coughs> And of course, we've got a fucked up engine too, so no idea if this is even going to work. Actually, you know what? This might be a good spot for a screenshot, so I'll be right back with you all once we start heading this way. And we're back. Here we go. Let's see. Seeing as I can't see anything out that... I guess I can, actually. These mirrors are actually really good. The whole escort system is really cool. See where the edge of that trailer hangs. Making sure to keep it within that bridge limit. <coughs> Alright, so keep our wheels pretty close to right on that line. We can do that. I don't like that sound. <coughs> Excuse me. 
Granted, I want to do like a Peterbilt or Kinsworth, something that's got, you know, not a smooth cab like this one. But when I saw that this was in the game, I, I could not try. So, fingers are crossed that we're not going to have anybody. Oh, God, that doesn't sound good at all. Anybody kind of obstructing our, our area. This looks fine right now. Sneak on over here. So there's only a couple locations that it seems that actually have these. So I don't, you know, we're going to try to do a couple of them. I'm just not sure, you know, if it'll be a regular thing. I really want to go through them, especially since there's one that's a, a home, a mobile home. I've always been saying that that's what I've always wanted. Also, I decided to do this one at night because I know a lot of oversized stuff goes at night. Shift. Ah, <laughs> uh, just the feel, it just feels heavy. Makes you feel like you're rolling the road, though. I will say that. How long is this trip, anyways? I didn't even look at Oh, it's only like three hours. I didn't think they'd be long. They're just, they're a little bit more complicated than normal. So, super excited about it. I do hope that wherever we're pulling into will be just kind of a pull-in kind of spot. <laughs> Ain't no way I'm getting this in any anywhere. You unload it where I drop it. But I hope you guys are having a good day. Like I said, Ella just came home from surgery. She went in this morning. Um, I've been like a nervous wreck recording videos all day. It's making me feel better. I like that. Get an arrow every once in a while. Let me know where we gotta go. Thank you, sir. Never thought I'd be using my mirror so much. Also, I think the biggest thing why I'm not the biggest fan of the in-game truck, and this is gonna sound stupid, okay? But bear with me. Uh, the main reason is um, my mirrors, the back of them are chrome. I can't make them matte. I can't make them match the truck either. I can't make them black. It's got to be chrome. So I'm a little bummed about that. I'm just kind of like, oh, well, that's out. So waiting for that mod to be updated, and then we'll get back to our long hauls. For right now, we'll be doing a couple of these, maybe a couple flatbed hauls. Um, Got to wait for that, like I said, that mod to be updated. And then hopefully getting back into some coast-to-coast -coast stuff. i got to figure out where that mod stands. And yet again... Since it's been going through so many changes. I've also got to wait for Featherlight to be fixed. Hopefully that's fixed by next year, because I have a lot of plans for that. And if it's not, we will just have to revert the game back to oof, long, long time ago. And, but we can. We, we will do that. But I don't want to. I just hope the mod gets updated. How often do you have a giant box go through your neighborhood, my friends? <laughs> yeah, that mod's still broken. On sign textures. Definitely hope nobody's coming, because I need, like, all the road for this. I guess I don't need technically that much road, but... My job is to get this box there safe. <coughs> also, I don't even know what's in it. That's a thing. They picked the windiest road for us to take, huh? I could pick up the speed a little bit. Ooh, a little bump there. Didn't hit anything. I like that they just don't want you to stop. Now these are these are specialty things. You know, once we drop it off, it will be picked up by another person. But what I really like is the escort system is really cool. Yeah, that's the horn for this thing, by the way. 
that's actually really cool. Since they knew it was going to be windy, they blocked off traffic. That's that's well thought out gameplay. All right, that's really good. Come on, you got this hill. Come on, you got it. There we go. But no, this is good. This is cool. Let's see what it doesn't look like from the outside. Without completely destroying everything that we've got here. At least the sun's coming up. We might be able to get a better screenshot then. We will find out as we get closer. <laughs> Funny, usually I'm talking away. I'm just trying to focus on. Never had to focus this much on driving in the game. <coughs> I am in the middle of the road. I 100% understand that. I'm just trying to make sure that we don't clip horses. Neat. Uh, make sure we don't clip anything. But it's so funny because now I'm thinking about it. I really, really miss driving around our featherweight trailer. It always happens when I take a break from the game. And then I'm like, man, that's actually what I miss doing. I love going coast to coast with that thing. So fingers are crossed that he finishes it soon. If he doesn't, I guess maybe I'll start thinking about sending him money. Be like, hey, can you finish this for me? All right, we are going to have a truck up here. Ready to suck it in. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Leave our lights on. Still, look at that. Go back into the regular view so I don't clip this car. Too busy look being in awe at this point. Don't speed up. Don't hit the back. Make sure we keep it up to that 35. Beautiful sunrise coming over the horizon. I gotta see what this would look like for a screenshot. We'll be right back. All right, you are going to see one more edit. I'm going to come right up behind this cop. Don't run him over, though. There we go. That's a good one. Just wanted to encompass the uh, escort car. And again, why did you put us on some ass-backward roads? Probably because there's no overpasses. Well, there you go. Mm. That one we definitely touched a little bit. Probably fine, right? Yeah, we're fine. But it's great, never hurt. I also got no points taken away, so. Still an hour and 16 minutes away. Yeah, what's up with this cop not doing his job and blocking off people from uh, coming through? All right, we're up to 40 miles an hour. Hopefully it straightens out a little bit more. Try doing this up in Oregon, you know, with all the uh, bridges and mountains. That would be funny to see. Oh man, still windy. I'm gonna go with the idea that, oh my god, nobody's gonna be coming through here because I need all this room. keep saying that because it's going to keep popping up being a pin, but I do like starting to see empty trailers. That's actually been really cool. I've seen a couple empty flatbeds too. Just 
Populate the game with the stuff that you have at your fingertips. Still probably about an hour away. Making some pretty good time, though. Thank you for blocking them off. <coughs> I know I'm on the rumble strip. Got other vehicles to be worrying about. And let's get it set up for this bridge. There's another cop. Why aren't you helping? Uh, I can only imagine how much it would cost to get this all going. This is a beautiful part of California. Why have we not been up here before? I have no idea. It's beautiful though. Oh, we got a bike cop. That's cool. Get kind of right here. That's where I like to be. Helicopter. Whoa. I cut that way too close, didn't I? <laughs> How can you tell? Crash, crash, crash. It's too busy looking over here. One of our escort vehicle sitting there. Everything's okay. Preferred if I didn't keep hitting, you know, the thing that we're paying millions for. I assume it's big. I'm gonna assume it's expensive. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Funny, I'm not sick, but I guess I'm just not used to talking this much again. Even though I'm a teacher and I talk every day for a living. turn, super wide turn. Thank you for stopping all the way up there. Much appreciated. Are they filming us? Definitely feel like they're filming us. Maybe they're just filming over there. Nothing going on over there. It's like a giant generator. You know, something that couldn't be assembled on site had to be assembled off site and then delivered to you. I wonder if it actually tells us. Do, do you tell us what we're what we're carrying? Massive tech part. Oh, good. Helpful. It's funny. I'd actually rather go through small town Americas than I would go through that <coughs> twisty hill again. By the way, there are sleeping spots everywhere now. I don't know if they've been updated or what, but they, they just seem like they're everywhere. Like this motel. I've never seen that texture before. good don't take off anybody's bumper we are almost there the end is in sight what the heck is that cop car doing look at it go look at it it's like duh, 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 duh. okay you know what's not good the fact that you didn't clear out this area Helicopter overhead. The question is, are we going to have enough to be able to make that trailer and not clip these people? Yeah, we're, we're past it. We're good. We should have a walkie talkie to the guy in the back, though. here. <coughs> Hold on. Now we're going to... Yeah, okay. So it's going to block traffic for us. Thank you very much. This whole experience as a whole has been amazing.
There's the crew. Yep, there is a TV crew too. So I don't know what they're getting, but it's it's important. Points you get for that crap. That's awesome. You have another long one for us, too. Of course, there's not another one. They're hard to find. But we definitely will find them. Well, let's pop out here. Can we turn those off? Turn off our engine. Turn off our lights. But that was successful, and that was actually a lot of fun. I like seeing this in the game. It's still not my preferred, but hey, when I bought the game, I would have loved another option there in the very beginning before I started doing any modding. So I understand where they're coming from, and I'm really happy to see the progress that this game is making. And it just seems like it's making faster and faster progress all the time. But that's going to do it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, we do live stream on Twitch, and we are on Instagram. Those links are down there in the description below. Let us know down in the comments what you think. I'd love to be able to hear from you guys. Really excited about this. Sorry that it feels like it's probably coming out late to you all. It's new to me. I'm going to be doing a handful of them. It's going to be a good time. Uh, if you like the video, a thumbs up is always appreciated. And if you really want to show your support, a subscribe is much appreciated. It just lets us know that we are doing something right. But with that, I thank you guys so much for coming out to this one. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.